If you are having trouble viewing HBO Max on your smart TV, we have you covered. Here we will show you how to sign into HBO Max on your TV and watch your favorite shows. Welcome back to Silicophilic, your go-to source for tech tips and fixes. Before we move forward, make sure to subscribe to our channel and like this video. It's free and helps us a lot. We do tons of research to find the working solutions for you. Your little support will help us continue making solution videos for you and others. So let's dive right in. Method 1 Reinstall HBO Max on TV HBO Max launched its supported app for TV of certain models. If your TV is one of them, you can directly install the HBO Max app and then enjoy the HBO Max movie playback on your smart TV without extra help. Connect your TV to a Wi-Fi network or Ethernet. Go to the app section, use the search menu to find HBO Max and select Done. Select the install button to download HBO Max. Once you have downloaded the HBO Max app on your smart TV, open the app. Select a show that needs a subscription. Click on the sign in button. Then confirm by clicking on sign in option from the next page. You will be required to sign in using your smartphone or PC. For that, go to the following website and enter the code provided on the screen hbomax.com forward slash tvslgnin You should stay on the screen while you sign in from your PC or smartphone. Enter the code and click on the next button. Now enter the HBO Max account sign in username and password on your mobile or PC. Then click on the sign in button. When asked who is watching, select your account and your video should start playing. If you haven't set up an HBO Max account yet, use your PC or smartphone to sign up for HBO Max, as signing up from your smart TV can be a bit cumbersome. Follow HBO's on-screen guide on signing up for the HBO Max ad-based or ad-free plan. After making payment and completing the sign-up process, open your smart TV Log in to the HBO Max with the HBO Max TV sign-in code and enjoy your movies and shows. And there you have it. We hope one of these methods worked for you. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and troubleshooting guides. Leave a comment and help others know which solution solved your problem. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video.